Big Booch with Direct Audio live in the studio today. We got Hollywood and Hood. Please tell everybody where y'all from. Uh, well, originally, you know what I'm saying, I'm from, I'm from Southside Buffalo County, Bonneton Road, you know what I'm saying, Southside Buffalo County, my man right here, he'll let him explain where you from and whatnot. I'm from uh, New Bern, North Carolina, and uh, we both linked up in Aurora, that's where we that's where we at now. Shout out to the A, piece of A town down, you already know, Southside Buffalo County, where we at. Okay, Aurora, I remember Aurora from school, but I remember from about Aurora from school, was a well, about fossils and what was a fake false fake? Yeah, 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 yeah. false fake. Yeah, okay, that's, yeah, yeah. That's how I uh, work at. It's a you know, it's a small town or whatever, but that's like the biggest thing around there. Okay, now I just recorded your song. People know I'm be hearing it later on for the first time. Please tell me how to explain your music. What when you think of your music? What? Do, how do you explain it? How do you explain somebody your music? Well, uh, well, we, we're, as as you can see, we're together. You know what I'm saying? But you know, everybody has their own views, their own opinions on everything. But uh, man, our music for everybody, like you know what I'm saying, from the kids to the grown ups to the old folks. You know what I mean? For the trappers, for the rappers, for the actors, for whoever. You know what I'm saying? You do what you do. We we we're from an environment where we, that's what we had to do. We did whatever it took to make it. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of it comes from most of it comes from the heart. You know what I'm saying? It, it comes from what we does on a regular basis. We struggle, we grind, we hustle, you know what I'm saying? Whether it be good, bad, or whatever, you know what I'm saying? We gotta do what it takes to make it, make it survive for our fan, bro. Okay, now, I talk to a lot of rappers, and, and I sit down with a lot of rappers. I ask them two questions. What is your strong part, point with the music, and what do you think is your weakness? Because everybody has a strong part and a weakness. What do you think is yours? Really, I feel like being us, being by we working so much, being consistent. Okay. But as far as, you know, getting together, putting music down, whatever, that's no problem, you know. And uh, that's all I can say. Well, I, I'm, I'm about like what bro said, man. Like, as far as consistency, you know what I'm saying? It's not the fact that we can't do it consistently, yeah. but with, with, with a work schedule and being able to have to do this and that, you know what I'm saying? We got families to take care of, kids, moms, pops, whatever, you know what I mean? And just other activities that we do on a regular basis, you know what I mean? So, that's the first, like I said, that's probably our, our weakness, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, as far as our strength, the song is part of, of, of our, you know what I'm saying, rapping is like we can, we can do it consistent, yeah. you know what I'm saying? That's the flip side of the situation, I mean, like, it's no problem. Like, if you want us to go in and lay it down in 10, 20 minutes, we can do that, you know what I'm saying? We have to write it or freestyle it, whatever you want. We, we versatile, we can switch it up, do whatever, you know what I mean, however you want it. Okay, so y'all working on a mixtape, an album, you, you trying to get music to iTunes, because everybody's got to... Back in the day, everybody just want to put an album out, go platinum. But that those days is gone. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We just two weeks ago had the first platinum album of the year. Did you know that? No, that's not no, no that. albums this year went platinum. No what? albums. What was the, it? Uh, the first one that went platinum, uh, I think it was uh, 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 the white girl. Um, Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel you know they said yeah. Taylor. Sometimes they set people up to fall to bring them back up. That's what they did. Kanye was a scapegoat for that. Okay. Do y'all do y'all speaking of Taylor Swift? Do y'all do anything outside of rap? Are you are you you know do you do remixes? You know I have a lot of artists. They might come in and get on a rock remix. Right. Or, you know expand your your thing. I mean that's the best way to go. You know be uh, versatile with it. You know do different things. You know you never know where it can take you. That's what we try to push for, different, you know, something different. Something different, okay. Now, if I'm thinking right, Aurora, that's right in between New Bern and, uh, where, where am I going? New Bern, Hamaco area. area, right by the water and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, we're in the water. Okay, area. now, it's winter now. Right. But the summertime, are y'all going to use that scenery down there with the water and the, the beaches and everything for the video. Do y'all got basically? Do y'all got the songs for the women? We, yeah, we got a good concept. Uh, what we, what we going. I mean, was it be for the women or you know talking about the struggles? You know, okay. it's, it's a good scenery down there for us. So. Now, before we end this interview up, now I got I got a, a crazy question I'm gonna ask you. All right. We all black men. Yeah. We all American. We middle aged men. You know what I'm saying. 
with you knowing right now that in Missouri they've already put the lockdown on the whole state, what is your real take on the Mike Brown situation and with the cop, the deliberation? I feel they've already let the guy off. They just ain't put the word out. That's why they're telling everybody to prepare for it. Because right. we went through that with Rodney King back in the day. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, as artists now, we have to be more socially conscious and look at the situation because we got kids now. Right. You know what I'm saying? And and things that's happening now is going to affect their future. Mm -hmm. So what what is, as a group, what does y'all take on the whole Mike Brown situation out in the middle of, as my mom say, the monkey in Missouri? <laughs> well, uh, me, man, personally, like, I've, I've been into it, we've been hearing a lot about it, you know what I'm saying? You know, you, I look at it from both views, from, from that side, from the police standpoint, and from me being a young black male, and from that standpoint, too. And I honestly, I can say I wasn't there, so I can't really say what happened, but I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, it's, it's easy to say. Yeah, yeah, safe to it, you know what I'm saying? Because they, there's plenty of witness out there, a young black man, you know what I'm saying? He, he, he didn't have nothing wrong, just like to the deserving case, you know what I'm saying? It's all about the same thing, Trevor Martin, you know what I mean? And it's what it is, is. These people are getting authority and overusing it. You yeah. know what I mean? So, I mean, I say, hey, I, honestly, I don't, I believe the man was done wrong, you know what I'm saying? But I can't really say say whether he was done wrong or not. But, like I say, I know how it goes, you know what I'm saying? The yeah. same thing happened right here in our own community, right here on the yeah, east side, yeah. you know what I mean? So, and it's every day, no matter where you go with, it's authority. And it may, may be a white cop, maybe a black cop, you know what I'm saying? But it's all the same, man. And uh, I feel, honestly, I just hope justice is done right for the young black man, you know what I'm saying? And that's basically all I can say about it. Okay, it, we have a lot of young, young, young guys and young aspiring rappers. I'm gonna throw a word out to you: respect. When you hear the word respect, what is what does that take towards your your inner soul? Because some people, to me nowadays, don't understand what respect is. You right. know what I'm saying? So, what what does y'all take on respect? Let me get yeah, yeah, yeah. let me get Hollywood first. Um. Miles is basically, how can I put it? Mm. Hey, with me, honestly, like, I'm, like I say, young black man and braised up in a good household or whatnot, but respect, man, it, it goes a long way. You see what I mean? Like, first, the first thing and foremost, without respect, you got to give respect to get respect. You know what I'm saying? And also with me, yes, sir, no ma'am. You know what I'm saying? Yes, ma'am, no sir, whatever. You know what I mean? And, Yes, please, thank you, and all that, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, like I say, uh, respect goes carries you a long way in life, you know what I'm saying? And um, that's, the, that's the most important thing, you know what I'm saying? No matter what you do in life, you got to carry yourself with respect and give respect, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, like I said, that's, that's the most important thing as far as I'm concerned, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, it takes you a long ways. Like I said, in order to give respect, you got to give respect. Like, we don't see it that way, but you do unto others as you have them do unto you, pretty much, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I feel yeah. the same way. And that that's good. Now I'm gonna let y'all give. I know you, you want to give some shout outs. You I know some guys done told you. I done heard you on the phone. They they getting the bottles ready for the boys back home. I'm just letting you know. So, so uh, give out some shout outs. You know anything you want to add to the end? Let the people know where your social media network, how to get in contact with you if they want to book you. You know, give it all to them. Um. First thing first, you know what I'm saying? First thing first, shout out to it, you know what I mean? South Side, Wolf County, you know what I'm saying? A Town, peace up, A Town, down, you already know how I go. From there all the way up to BC, Bonington, Elwood, D Block, y'all already know how I go. What up, what up, you know what I mean? And uh, y'all looking for me, you know what I'm saying? Hood Rich, BTB, Facebook, James Moore, Facebook, you know what I'm saying? I don't do the Twitter, I don't do the Instagram, you know what I'm saying? I'm in the hood though, you know what I'm saying? You looking for me, it's asking about me, we there. And then change, y'all already know how it goes, you know what I'm saying? And shout out to my boys out there, everybody. I don't want to say no names, you know what I mean? Because everybody's doing their own situation, but y'all already know who y'all is. You know what it is. You can look for me on Anthony Moore on Facebook. Shout out to that Marcy America coming soon, too. And, uh, deuces. Yeah. <laughs>